Hello welcome back to Imiphone channel. Friends are you also upgrading to iOS 18? Your device may crash, stuck in boot loop, black screen and other issues and want to go back to the previous version. Here is how to downgrade iOS 18 to 17. Let's go. Before you want to downgrade the system here read two points to consider before you want to downgrade the system. 1. Since Apple would stop signing older version of iOS a few days after a new version is released, you can only downgrade to the latest version of iOS, which is the currently signed version. 2. Downgrading will result in erasing all the data and settings from your iPhone, so make sure to back up your iPhone before performing the downgrade with iTunes and iCloud. If you want to downgrade with iTunes, it may have to go through a lot of errors for your convenience. If you want to downgrade iOS easily with one click, this iOS downgrade tool, iMyPhone Fixbo, is the one you can't miss. And then I show you how to downgrade with iTunes. Method 1 Downgrade iOS 18 Beta with Imiphone Fixbo Step 1 Download Imiphone Fixbo from the bio in the descriptions below and launch Fixbo, then choose the iOS upgrade slash downgrade from the interface. Step 2 Click the iOS downgrade to downgrade from iOS 18 beta to iOS 17. Step 3 Connect your iPhone to PC with USB. Follow the on-screen instructions to put your iPhone into recovery mode. For iPhone 8 and above, instantly click and release the volume up key and then the volume down key. Press and hold the side button until you see this. Step 4 Fixbo will detect your iPhone system and show you the available iOS firmware version to download and downgrade. Click the download button to get the iOS firmware for downgrading, when the firmware is downloaded, click the start downgrade iOS button for Fixbo to begin downgrading your current iOS version to older iOS. In a few minutes, the downgrading process will be complete. Your iPhone will be rebooted automatically and you can see that your iPhone is now reverted to the iOS 17 from iOS 18 beta. Enjoy your previous stable iOS system. Method 2 Downgrade iOS 18 beta with iTunes To downgrade using iTunes, you must search and download the IPSW file manually. Visit ipswu.me to find the iOS files for your iPhone model, download the file, and wait for the process to finish. Plug your iPhone into your PC. Open iTunes, and navigate to your iPhone. Hold the Shift key on your keyboard, and press Restore. Select the Restore.ips file that you downloaded. Wait for the Restore to complete, and the iPhone to reboot. If you encounter an error or file support issue with iTunes, you can try using the alternative method of iMyPhone Fixbo. Let me show you some iOS 18 amazing features. Press and hold any blank area on the main screen, or any app icon, until all apps start shaking, then tap on Edit at the top left corner of the main screen, Customize, to choose the color theme for app icons and widgets from the menu below. Keep your finger pressed on an empty space on the main screen, or any app icon, until all apps shake, then tap on Edit at the upper left of the main screen, Customize, to choose the size of app icons. You can protect your privacy by setting a password for your apps. Just long press the app to set the password. You can also swipe the right side toolbar to easily navigate to the function you want. In the Notes app, long press the text to set different colors and highlight the important points of your text. In the Photos app, you can adjust the layout by long pressing on the album name. In addition, the interface of the computer has been greatly improved. Function keys for equations have been added, and by swiping right while holding the side, you can see your past calculation records, which is very convenient.
Okay, that's all for today's video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. If you found this video helpful, share them with your friends.